Hi, welcome again to Wilson's Weekday Wines. Today we are drinking something different for me. It's a white, not my usual reds, and I swear by reds. I decided to mix it up. We are drinking a 2020 Ovum Memorista Tradition. This is a Riesling, and it is, believe it or not, I think more full-bodied when I chilled it more. So when I first opened this, it was 55, 58 degrees from the wine, probably 58 degrees from the wine fridge that I stored it in. And I thought it was a bit thin. I thought it was uh, kind of not that memorable, uh, not very sweet. And it's gotten better, much, much better. So I should have, I should have opened it, put it in the refrigerator for an hour, and then started drinking it. Because now that this small amount, the last part of the bottle, has been in the refrigerator for the last hour while we were eating dinner, I think this last half glass I have is the best that I've had so far. Like I said, when I first opened it, I was kind of like, eh, this is why I don't drink white. This is really thin bodied and kind of forgettable. Now it is, um, it's thicker. There's a honeysuckle floral taste, maybe a little bit of lemon, but still on the dry side from what I remember from Riesling. I, I haven't had a Riesling in years, so my taste buds may be very far out of whack or in, in my reckoning of what these taste like, but I thought it would be sweeter. Um, still good though. So I bought uh, Ovum because I read about them in the Riesling edition of Wine and Spirit magazine while well, they had other grapes, but they had Riesling featured. And then they had like a 95 pointer. Went to their website, it was sold out, but I was able to buy this and I think three other white wines that they had that are all Riesling. So there's more stuff coming to the channel from Ovum. Uh, they shipped during the summer, they put ice packs in there. I, th I think it survived, I think it's okay. Um, they have some notes on here about the soil, ancient ocean and volcanic soil. The, it says Ovum, Quiet Wines of Place, 2020 Oregon Riesling. So a uh, neat picture in the front of this press, old school press. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm interested to try some more stuff. Like I said, this is outside of my comfort zone. I'm not a, a white wine guy at all. But it is summer, it's July, and yeah, something different. Definitely we'll open the next one and let it sit in the fridge for an hour. I'm going to try that and report back and see if the whole bottle is good because in this case, the last glass is the best. So thanks for watching. More, more room varietals coming. Don't worry. I'm not going to the white wine side, but there will be some other things like this to mix it up. So talk to you soon. Cheers.